Hi Pre-K, it's me, Miss Bobby. Thank you for joining me today for our Math Fluency. We will review these things. We are going to go over our shapes, square, circle, triangle, rhombus, rectangle, and oval. The terms that we will be using are elongated, face, corner, side. The game that we will play is let's make a, and the materials that I will be using are popsicle sticks, pipe cleaners, and I will get one egg. First, let's review this shape. What is the name of this shape? A square, very good. Where are the sides of the square? This is a side. This is a side, this is a side, and this is a side. How many of those sides does a square have? One, two, three, four. Very good. Now, where are the corners of the square? Here's a corner. Here is a corner, here is a corner, and here is a corner. How many corners does it have? Very good. One, two, three, four. A square has four corners and four sides. Where is the face of the square? Where is the face of the square? This is the face of the square. This is a 2D shape, and this is a face of the square, right here in the middle. This is the face of the square. Very good. Now, with my popsicle sticks, let's practice making a square. I'm going to take four popsicle sticks. Let's make the lines or the sides of the square. Let's make the sides of the square. Let's make this side. Let's make this side. Let's make this side and this side. Now, where are corners supposed to be? Our corners are supposed to be here, right? Our popsicle sticks aren't touching yet, so let's make it touch each other. Now, now where are my corners? Very good, my corners are here, 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 and here. Good job, everybody. Now that we have reviewed a square, we will review another shape. What is the name of this shape? Very good, this is a rectangle, a rectangle. Could you tell me what you know about a rectangle? A rectangle has two long sides, and two short sides, very good. How many sides does it have? Good, four sides. One, two, three, four. How many corners does it have? Good, it has four corners. 
One, two, three, four. Very good. Where is the face of the rectangle? The face of the rectangle is right here in the middle. Very good. This is the face of the rectangle. Now, let's grab our popsicle sticks and let's make a rectangle. What should our sides look like? Should they be short or long? They should be both short and long. Very good. Trick question, huh? I should have two long sides. So let's make a long side. Let's use two popsicle sticks to make a long side. Now let's make our short sides. Hmm, how can we make our short sides? I can put one here and I can put one here. Now my rectangle has two short sides and two long sides. Very good. Do you know the name of this shape? This shape has two names. It is called a diamond and the math way it is called a a rhombus. Very good. It is called a rhombus. Good job. I want you to use the word rhombus, the term rhombus. Now let's talk about these lines. What do these lines look like to you? They look like they're, they're kind of going to the side, kind of like an angle, right? Yeah. How many lines does it have? Where, where are the sides? How many sides does it have? Four. One, two, three, four. How many corners does it have? One, two, three, four. Very good. Where is the face of the rhombus? Here's the face of the rhombus. Very good. Now, let's try to make the rhombus. How many popsicle sticks do you think I need to make the rhombus? How many lines did we have? We have four lines, right? We have four sides, right? So we might need how many popsicle sticks? Four, very good. Let's try to, let me try to make this rhombus. Did I make the rhombus? Not quite, right? What do I need to do with this popsicle stick? Okay. Very good. There's my rhombus. What shape is this? This is a circle, very good. Now, does this circle have any corners? No, it does not. Does it have any sides? No, it does not. Does it have a face? Yes, it has a face. Where is the face? The face is right here. Very good. I am going to use a pipe cleaner to make the circle because I can bend it. I can't use these popsicle sticks because they are straight. They're like straight lines and I can't bend it because if I bend it, look what happens. It breaks. So I can't use the popsicle stick. So right now my, pops, my pipe cleaner looks like this. I'm going to Shape it into a circle. There we go. I made a circle. Good job. Do you know the name of this shape? Very good. It's a triangle. I wonder why they call it a triangle. The word tri means three. T-R-I, tri means three.
because a triangle has how many sides? It has three sides, very good. Let's count the sides of this triangle. One, two, three, very good. How many corners does a triangle have? Good job, one, two, three. Where is the face of this triangle? Very good, the face is right here. This is the face of the triangle. Let's try and make our triangle with, should we use our pipe cleaners or popsicle sticks? What do you think will be easiest? Let's try to make it with a pipe cleaner first. I'm gonna try and squeeze it. Squeeze it. Hmm. It worked pretty well, but let's also try to make it with our popsicle sticks. How many do you think I need? How many sides does it have? Three, very good. Let's use three popsicle sticks. One, two, where would this one go? Oh, down at the bottom, very good. It's three. There's a triangle, very good. The last shape that we will review is called an, an oval. This is an oval, very good. Now, where are the corners of an oval? Good, there are no corners. Where are the sides of an oval? There are no sides. But where is the face of the oval? Very good, the face is right here. What does an oval remind you of? What do we have that we cook with? What, what can we cook for breakfast that reminds you of an oval? It's an egg. An egg is the same shape as an oval. An oval is also an elongated circle. So let me show you what can happen. If my pipe cleaner started out as a circle, What can I do to make it look like an oval? I can elongate my circle. I can stretch my circle. Let's stretch it. Now it looks like an oval. Very good. Good job, everybody, going over those shapes. Now it's time to play our little game. I am going to give you 10 seconds, that's 10 seconds, to make a shape that I call out. Your shape has to look just like my shape when I get done making my shape. Are you ready? So gather your popsicle sticks, or you can use... Um, pencils, you can use popsicle sticks, you can use markers. I suggest you use about six of them. You bring six of them. Are you ready? Make a square. Do you have your square? All right, let's see. Does your square look like this? Very good, okay. Make a triangle. Make a triangle. 10, 
nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ding, 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 ding. Time's up. Did you make your triangle? How many sides does your triangle have? Three. Does it look like this? Very good. Let's do one more. Make a rectangle. You have to make a rectangle. Remember, a rectangle is an elongated square. So it's like you're stretching the square. Make a rectangle. 10 seconds, here we go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ding, 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 time's up. Did you make your rectangle? Let's see. Ooh. Did you make your rectangle? I bet you did. Very good. Thank you guys for watching. You guys did an amazing job with these shapes. And next week, we will review something new. I hope to see you guys soon and have a great day.